Hey everybody and welcome back to Misfit Corner Scams. This is Sarah Snows Andrew speaking and it's time for another scam call. I know everybody gets these calls where you get a call saying they're calling about your car warranty. Oh yeah, they're calling to offer you a new extended plan or whatnot. A lot of times they don't even know who you are. They don't know anything about you or your car. This time they knew my wife's name, which is kind of ironic because it's attached to the telephone number. But it's not attached to any car we've ever owned, or at least not the one that we've owned in the last 10 or 15 years. We only have one car, and I bought it. It's in my name. So the fact that they had her name means they only had the telephone number, and that's it. That's why I started asking and pressing the question when they said they sent me several notifications. Well, where did you send those notifications to? Because I've never gotten a single one. Anyway, the whole concept of this call as they start out the lie from the very beginning. They tell you they're calling about, you know, whatever records they have about your car. They don't know anything about you or your cars. They don't know anything at all, and I love wasting their time. Needless to say, this guy, very unprofessional, couldn't answer a simple question, and I love it when they call. So if you get calls like this, remember, either hang up on them or screw with them like I do. It's always fun. Enjoy. Hello? Hi, this is Alicia. How are you today? Oh, very good. That's good. I am calling because we have sent you several notifications on extending your car warranty, but we haven't heard back. And this is one of the last courtesy calls to let you know that you can still keep your vehicle under coverage. So would you like to know more about your options? Oh, goodness. Where, where did you send the notices? Because I don't think I ever received any. What was that? I asked where you sent the notices, because I don't remember receiving any. Did you send it via the mail or email or how? I am new here, so let me get you to someone who can answer that question much better than I can. Oh, okay. Is that okay? Yes, that's that's fine. Thank Hold you. Hold on. Hold on a sec. Okay. Yeah, hi, thank you for holding. My name is Robert. I'm the coverage representative assigned to the vehicle. And first and foremost, how would you say it's running for you overall now? Oh, not too bad. Uh, Robert, the, the young lady before you said that you guys had sent me several notices, and I don't remember receiving anything. How, how did you send them to me? Was it email or by mail? or? Yeah, it, 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 it's registered in Jennifer's name. Is she available, sir? Oh, so you're not going to answer the question, huh? Sir, the vehicle is not registered in your name. It's registered in Jennifer's name, sir. Is she, is she available? The, the lady before you said you had sent us several notifications, and I don't remember receiving anything. I'm her husband, so you can talk to me. And I'm asking you, oh, okay. how did you send the notifications? Because I don't remember receiving anything. Uh, so, well, first and foremost, they offered it to you at the time of purchase. The lady, and then they mailed you two notes. the lady before me. You. Okay, go uh, ahead. And then they ma- yeah. I'm sorry to interrupt. Go ahead. Say what you were saying. Robert, come on, man. You can do this. Don't give up on me already. Robert, are you telling me I ask you a simple question and you panic and leave the call? Robert, you suck at this job, man. If you can't answer a simple question, or at least deflect a simple question, or make up an answer to a simple question, you're going to suck at this job. You know that? Horrible, horrible customer service. I don't normally do this, but we're calling that number back. Sorry, but this number is not currently configured. The IT department will be notified. Really? Okay. Well, hopefully somebody in the IT department knows how to do their job, and maybe they'll call me back. Hey, everybody, and thanks a lot for checking out the video. If you like the content, click the subscribe button and hit the bell for notification. Leave us a comment. Let us know what you think. Thumbs up, thumbs down, either way, and we'll catch you all next time.